Hey, this is Angie. And I'm Ryan. And we are Happy, Happy Healthy. Healthy. Vegan. Vegan. Don't suck baby again. No. And we're going to prove it to you today. Totally. Not that you guys need proof. No. So anyways, we are shooting a video for the Happy Fam. It's been a really long time, I know. And uh, I guess this joke's getting a little bit old about guess where we where are. Where are we? Do you know yet? <laughs> Comment in the live chat if you're watching on the live chat. If you want to take a guess where you think we're heading. If you have a hunch, you're probably right. You're probably right. <laughs> I, I, I feel like the last video we shot was here as it well. Was, uh, we'll promise we'll do something every next time. <laughs> That's right. We're back. Already that time of the year. It's crazy. Halloween-y stuff. Everywhere. I thought it was about Batman. <laughs> it's always weird to celebrate Halloween. I feel like you should be when it's like 80 degrees out know, and tons crazy. of sunshine. <laughs> but it'll be That's like dark and cold green. by Halloween. Here in Disney California Adventure, they have little sections that are parts of California. This is wine country. Clearly. Yeah, there's actual wine grapes here. I'm not sure what varietal or anything, but... Um, oh, yeah. You should find out. I thought they were going to bottle it at some point. Whoa. Huh, I can't say I see the grapes yet. Found them. Found some grapes. Look, guys. They look something delicious. Now, see, they have a supposed winery, and this is, this is it here. I don't know if they have many wine events actually going on there. There's the grapes. Let's see what other info that they've got here. White versus red is the same way. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. All right, so our first stop is going to be a place known as the Magic Key Terrace. You need to have one of the season passes of Magic Keys to get in, and we have Magic Key Passes. That's how we come. Yes, we do. And they have some, um, a special vegan option there that we're quite fond of. Yes, it's changed a bit over the years, if you've seen any of our past videos. Yeah, they change out their menus all the time. But there's just one little vegan option right now, and we're going to get it. Yeah, here's one area of the Magic Key Terrace. Doubt we'll, I've never been seated right here, though. I know, it's weird. But if you're getting the vibe of the design here, it's supposed to look like a wine country winery. Yeah. Perfect. May I see your Magic Key Pass, please? We've never sat up here before. It's pretty nice up here. <laughs> Cat tiles. It's pretty. This is the Heimlich Choo Choo Juice. Let me just show you this cute detail here. Since he's been choo chooing on our watermelon, hopefully you know who Heimlich is. He's, he's from, from Bugs, Bugs Life. Life. Yeah, he's one of the few Disney IP characters we actually know in life. Ah. <laughs> and this is a really delicious juice. We had it for the first time last time we came, and we were just we've been talking about it ever since. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> What I was gonna say is it's a holdover from when they used to have a Bugs Life um, area here in DCA. Heimlich's Choo Choo And the Heimlich Choo Choo ride was the best. So cute, you guys. That's a ride. Thank you. Yeah, that's rad. Very magical. Yeah, oh, look at the big watermelon behind you. Yeah. But I'm glad this is still here. It's a watermelon juice, and this is green apple, and it's so refreshing, you guys. It's the perfect summer beverage. Oh, and there's no alcohol in it. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> it's for the kids. Mmm. <laughs> wow. Perfect for a day like this, huh? It really is refreshing. Mmm. Mm. Those colors. Oh, I love it. It tastes so watermelony. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. Delicious, guys. Avalon Cooler. We've never had it. It is a mixed drink that mixes wine and I think vodka and elderberry liqueur and I think lemon. Mm. Yeah, also very delightful for a summer afternoon. Oh, I want to try it. All right, I'm excited. Mm. Wow, so lemony. I have a sneaky suspicion that maybe I should blend this together with a straw. All right, now it's all blended up. Mm. Oh, it's so sweet now. Now that I taste all the elderberry and whatnot. Oh, there's strawberry puree is the other flavor. 
Oh my god, yeah. The strawberry flavor is strong. It's light and pretty and slimy. It's choo choo. Totally. Wow. I barely taste alcohol now. Though, or dangerous. Lower levels. Yeah, I know. I'm dangerous. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> mm. It's delicious. Wow. Quaffable. This is a nice little afternoon. Actually, if you just kind of sip with the straw, you'll get all of the apple flavor. Oh, wow. Yeah, try that out. Okay. Let's see what you think. Mm. Totally different from the watermelon part, huh? It, yeah, and it's funny, these two drinks, one alcoholic, one non, um, complement each other very well. They do. Mm -hmm. Summary. And we saw food coming. This is oh, cool. Oh, yeah. Good time. <laughs> I think I've got the name on this. I think it is the Impossible Sicilian Meatball Flatbread. So it's, it's on the plant based. It's the only thing on the plant based menu here at the Magic Key Terrace. So this ricotta cheese is plant based, and everything here. That base look, Ryan looks perfect. <laughs> if you guys are wondering, it's, <coughs> I'm sorry, it's kind of small, but yeah. we kind of tend to snack throughout the day rather than coming and eating giant meals here. Yeah. So I'm going to peel one off here. Yeah. Oh, I am seeing some garlic. Let's get that out. Hey, we we'll have to peel the garlic clothes off. I should have asked him to hold them. I forgot. Okay, I've de garlicified mine. <laughs> Oh, my image is kind of blurry. <laughs> <laughs> kind of blurry. Mm, I feel so California right now. Do you really? Mm. Hey, it doesn't suck being beat. I'll get a bit of the impossible. Oh, that smells good. Mm. Yeah. It's delicious. Oh. What a glorious evening. Ah, oh, so nice. Ah, so there's the grapes down there. Brian and I were saying that this looks like such a perfect place for one of the Disneyland feral cats to be hanging out at. Wow, I was a cat. I'd definitely be hiding here. A cat portrait. Now I'm getting really curious. You know, we haven't been able to come to Disneyland or DCA all summer long because our passes are blacked out. So we did actually pop by really briefly last week was the first time that we could use our passes again. And he got a reservation on Thursday and it was packed. It was like people were swarming in. Even rides that are normally only a five minute wait were like 20 minutes. So we just kind of got a snack and split and didn't film a video for you guys. So now we're back this Thursday and um, it looks reasonable. So hopefully we'll be able to go on a couple rides, get a few more things to eat and uh, have a little fun with you guys. The brand new San Francisco reboot of this area is now done and open. So we actually saw they were still working on this bridge last week when we popped by. So they really hustled up to get this ready in time for the big launch. Here's a better view of it. I heard there was like a three hour line to get in there and see everything and wow. meet the characters. So we'll come I don't, back tonight. I don't know, maybe that was yesterday. It'll be lit at night. It'll be lit? It'll be lit. It'll be lit. Are we lit right now? It'll be literally lit though. <laughs> San Francisco. Hey, you got it right. <laughs> <laughs> Jump and jelly face. We haven't been on this ride in months. Jump and jelly face. Remember, you were like afraid to go on I this was. like maybe three years. I probably got I you probably on it. I probably said it in a vlog. Like I'm not going on that. <laughs> I got you on it. You go. Oh, yeah. that was. That, that, was, that was it. That was easy. It was fun. <laughs> Especially like you know you get a nice breeze up there. Yeah, like, I'll, film, I'll film the ride so you can okay. see what we see. All right. There we go. It's crazy up here. I know, look at this mirror. Wow. There's our Zephyrs, they're being refurbished right now. We can't go on them. One more time, I think. Woohoo! It feels so nice. You get this awesome breeze up here. It's amazing. These are all like old fashioned style rides. Yeah, old like California. Um, Probably ocean like the Pike, yeah. kind of. Ocean amusement parks. Yeah. Oh, they're coming down. Da -da 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 
<laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. Walking right on to emotional whirlwind. We love this ride. We like the movie a lot too. I know, I can't wait for the new one. I dare you to jump another one that's in the Bing Bong candy let's, store. Let's show them that. I think All I right. might get kicked out of the park though. But, you probably yeah. would. It's not worth it. Yeah. It's not worth it. <laughs> Don't do it, babe. No, I'm not. Oh, oh man. So awesome. It's hard to see his face. He's going around the side. Open, hug him. Yeah, he's ready for your hug right now. There's where you won me my Your Heimlich. My treasured oh, Heimlich doll. Treasured. Woo! What a glorious freaking evening. So Ryan was just trying to order us something from the Lucky Fortune Cookery and they wouldn't accept any orders, so he's concerned. So let's just walk there and see what's up. Yeah, we'll just eyeball it. Yeah, we want to anyway. Lovely. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah. Okay, it is pretty busy over there. It's a lot of people. We'll see. It doesn't look any worse than our normal kind of. You don't think so? It looks, it looks more packed. Yeah, so a lot of people buy the margarita thing. Oh, uh, yeah. Did they change the name of that too? I think it's still Rita. They didn't used to have that Japanese fish guy on the top. Okay, I'll tell you guys, there is a vegan, finally there's an on the menu vegan item here, but it's really expensive. This here. Whew, so we shall go elsewhere. The app didn't lie. That was really packed in mass. I've never seen the Lucky Fortune cookery that uh -uh. packed. It was like maybe five, six times more packed than I've yeah, ever seen. So we have something else we've been wanting to try here anyway, and this is a perfect yeah. opportunity for us to do so. Why not? Good old shawarma palace. Yeah. Usually come here for breakfast. This is the first time we've had it for dinner. 
We're expecting good things. We always come in the morning to the Sharma Palace. And get their breakfast wrap, which is yeah. extremely delicious and yeah. a favorite of ours here. So the rest of the day, they have what's called the Impossible Victory Falafel Sandwich. Let us well. know if you know why down in the comments why it's Victory. Is that an Avengers thing? Yeah, I know. I wouldn't know. It comes with the sauce, too, I guess. Ooh, it's going to be those messy, boring sauce situations. Oh, yeah, the Yikes. wrap comes with a sticky maple leaf sauce, too. <laughs> Let's check it out. I'm just gonna dip it rather than. No, pour. don't dip it. Don't dip it? No. Okay, this kind of pouring? Yeah, pour it. Let me just pour a little bit before I hot commit to the whole thing. <laughs> Let me see what that's like. Let's see what it looks that's... like it'll be boring without it, honestly. Okay. All right, we're going all in. All right, you don't have to put the whole thing if you don't want. How many poker metaphors can I use here? <laughs> Alright, let's see what this is our first time ever having this one. <laughs> Alright, I guess it's the same stuff. It reminds me of going to um, Star Wars, having that. Oh, really? That kept the oh, and that's what thing. you wanted to get today, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, that is similar. It just has fewer veggies, I guess. It's more yeah. of the meatballs. Yeah, I think it is the same quinoa uh, impossible combo. Cool. Here we are just hanging out by Luigi's. <laughs> Here we go. Mm. It definitely tastes like a falafel for sure. But yeah, I think it would be better if it had the cucumbers and tomato like yeah. like the Star Wars sandwich has. Yeah. Sunset. Sunset continues. Wow. Buena Ventura Street, is that what they call it? Oh, um, I forgot <laughs> what they call this street. It's just the, the old Hollywood Boulevard. Totally. Oh, it's ready. Oh, it's ready? All right, I'll just wait here then. He's off to get some film fries. Here he comes. Here he comes. So what we're getting? Oh, yeah, those aren't film fries, those are curly fries. I don't know, that's oh. what they gave me. So sometimes they sub out the film fries, which are amazing. For something else, at least curly fries are decent. Oh, there's stuff in there? Oh, we're on a stop. Oh, man. <laughs> Should we take it? <laughs> Woo! Ooh, guys. So I think um, we might say goodbye right now. The video's not over, but I think we're just gonna try to walk over into Disneyland and I think the video could be over. <laughs> the video could be over. So, we're gonna say goodbye and thanks for watching our little day here at Disneyland. We haven't even been to Disneyland. Sounds like our little evening. Well, yeah, our little, little evening at Disneyland's California Adventure Park. A little escape at the end of the day. Yeah, it's getting breezy, it's nice. So yeah, the sun's going down, so I think I think we should, yeah. Yeah, so anyway, yeah, share your comments and thoughts down below what you think we're doing today here. <laughs> Let us know if you have any favorite foods that you eat here or if you saw anything we ate that looked pretty awesome. Did you miss our Disneyland videos? I want to know because I hear too much from haters, but I want to hear from people that are lovers. So yeah. do you like these videos? Let me know. <laughs> Comment down below. Give it a like. And uh, I guess until next time. Remember, don't like being vegan. Amy promise we'll make some more non-Disney videos soon.